navigating the intricate dance between technological advancements, shifting demographics, and evolving societal norms lies at the heart of this discussion. I can argue in the developed countries, the big winners are countries that have shrinking populations. Okay, that's something that most people never talked about. You know, we always used to think shrinking population is a, is a cause uh, for negative growth. But in my conversations with the leadership of these large developed countries that have <clears throat> xenophobic in, in, immigration policies, they don't allow anybody to come in, shrinking unemployment, excuse me, shrinking uh, demographics, <clears throat> these countries will rapidly develop robotics and, tech, and AI and technology. And, and if the promise, I didn't say it's going to happen, but if the promise of all that transforms productivity, which most of us think it will, we'll be able to elevate the standard of living of countries and the standard of living of individuals, even with shrinking populations. And so the paradigm of negative population growth is going to be changing. And the social problems that one will have in substituting humans for machines is going to be far easier in those countries that have declining populations. And so for those countries that have rising populations, the answer will be education. And so rapidly developing, you know, for those countries that do not have a foundation of rule of law or education, they're going to be left. That's where the divide's going to get more and more extreme. And unfortunately, Embracing the potential advantages of automation and AI to bolster productivity and enhance the quality of life becomes apparent, especially in nations facing declining populations. Nonetheless, ethical dilemmas arise concerning the repercussions on human dignity, employment opportunities, and societal harmony. There's a reluctance to view population decline as beneficial advocating instead for policies that prioritize human well-being and societal cohesion, leaning towards ideologies like socialism and communism over mere economic gains. Core principles, economic equilibrium and sovereignty are underscored. Within the discourse of immigration policies and shifting demographics, concerns arise regarding their impact on cultural identity and social unity. Public sentiment gravitates towards policies fostering stability, and safeguarding fundamental institutions, urging a balanced approach to technological advancements that preserves individual liberties and societal welfare. The interplay between technological innovation, demographic shifts, and their effects on individuals and communities becomes a focal point. Furthermore, the psychological dimensions of inequality and the imperative for inclusive policies fostering resilience and human flourishing amidst rapid technological progress, demand careful consideration.